What's up guys? Thank you guys so much for tuning into this video. I hope you enjoy it. Um, we're gonna try to get my brother on his first steel head ever on the fly rod. He's caught them on spinning gear and stuff like that. Um, this is the third part of the fall fishing recap series I've been doing. So if you haven't seen the other two, go check those out. And today is the last part and my personal favorite. So I hope you guys enjoy and stay tuned. I think I have just the recipe for the steel head. Cole's first steelhead. Oh yeah. I just don't understand why I'm like I'm keeping tension on the line and everything. I just don't get it. Now I'm just getting snags. took it and like ran like a bat out of hell. I've never lost five steelhead in a day and not landed one. Never, never. 
setting records. Not the ones I want to, though. Not good records, but I'm setting them. That's a fish. A small one, but it's a fish. Little brown trout. <laughs> That's funny. But you know what, Cole? I can't see him for shit. I'll bring him up to the top. Big scoop. You got him, Peyton. So this is my only catch of the day. <laughs> Don't do me like that, fish. This fish is gonna take a while, so just hold on to your butts. That makes all <laughs> that makes all those fish I lost worth it. That's beautiful. The colors on that fish. Oh, yeah. Okay, finally landed a decent one. Beautiful fish. Oh my gosh, that was an awesome fish. I'm so happy. What's up guys? Thank you so much for watching. I hope you stuck through the whole video. Um, I know I struggled a lot. We didn't catch the most fish, but it was such a great day of fishing. Watching my brother catch his first steelhead was one of my favorite experiences. Um, I think I was a lot more excited than he was. I was, I was giddy. I was so happy. He's been trying um, for that accomplishment for so long and like to see him do it and like on such like a quality fish was so amazing. And yeah, that was, 
that was one of my favorite days ever of fishing. Um, even though it was kind of frustrating for me, I lost a lot of fish that day, but that, you know, it happens. Um, so thank you guys so much for watching. Like I said uh, in the beginning of this video, this is the third part of my like fall fishing recap. I took these videos back in like November and December and I never got around to posting them. So I figured like I had the content, why not get it out? So this was the third and final part of that series. So if you guys can check out the part one or part two, I strongly encourage you to. Um, can just see me and I went out with Derek one day, I went out with Cole a different day, like we're just having fun, just fishing, um, it, just having a good time. So thank you guys so much for watching. Please subscribe, like, comment. Um, I'm going to be getting back to doing more like current content. I don't have any more fall fishing videos for you guys, but spring's coming, uh, end of winter. I might even end up doing some like winter hiking videos, like that kind of thing. Let me know what you guys want to see. I would really appreciate the feedback on like anything from the videos as well. If you guys, um, want to see more of something or don't want to see something, just let me know. I'd love to know. So thank you guys again. And I hope I see you guys next time. Uh, happy fishing. Spring is in the air. Spring is coming. Get excited, go fishing, do all that fun stuff. Um, thank you guys so much for tuning in and I'll see you next time.